today sugar is found in a lot of places that it wasn't before. It's it's still in like cakes and cookies and things like that, but it's also in cereals, breads, fat-free milk, canned veggies, baby food, peanut butter. It's in really all these crazy things that we would never know it was unless we looked at the label. Sugar is often on the label called corn syrup, dextrose, maltose, glucose, or fructose. All these words just mean sugar. You know, I saw a healthy drink or a healthy marketed drink at the grocery store yesterday. I just was curious and turned it around and it had 44 grams of sugar in it. So some of the times the sugar is hidden in things that you wouldn't think have a bunch of sugar because they're marketed as healthy or natural. Well, sugar in itself isn't isn't bad for you. You know, it occurs naturally in many foods, um, even rice, beans, vegetables. And when you eat sugar in this way, it breaks down evenly. It's easy for your body to digest. However, when we eat the refined sugars, this is very different because it lacks the vitamins and minerals and the fiber to digest. So. This actually requires a lot more from our own body, creating energy highs and lows. So you eat it and you get really hyper, sometimes even anxious, and then later you crash and you get really tired. This can even come in the forms of depression, you know, and sadness. I think different people have different ideas of what healthy is. But what I think healthy is, is about balance. And at the school I went to, it's called the Institute of Integrative Nutrition. They teach us that no food is inherently bad. And it's not what you eat once or a little bit that matters. It's more what you eat most of the time that matters. It's not rational to think that we're not going to have any sugar in our diet. Um, trying to do that would probably add more stress than it's worth to not eat the sugar. So. Um, basically, the biggest piece of advice I could give people is, is really, you know, be aware and do as much as you can, but, but just do the best that you can. It's not about being perfect, it's just about, you know, eating and being balanced and as healthy, whatever that means to you.